What's up, you filthy animals? We're back for another video, and uh, I'm not dead. I'm, I'm alive. I'm, I'm here. I, uh, I've been gone for a while, and I'm sorry about that for the people that have been following my channel. Uh, I had to take a break. Um, got zeroed pretty bad, like I said in the last video. But I just decided to take a break and uh, do some regular stuff with my life and work and do all that good stuff. So, you know, it's just one of them things. So anyway, we're back now. Uh, so lots of new things have happened since I was gone. We got different guards. We have new stuff with the airship. We have all sorts of good stuff that's out now. Um, let's see here. Uh, here with the airship, you can assign these abilities. I just started on this, so you know it looks like crap. So, um, so basically, you know, you got all this stuff going on right here. Uh, so this stuff all gives you bonuses to your attacks. Um, Oh, that's neat. I didn't know that. So, when you look at these things, uh, your uh, deals only work and are only activated when uh, your airship ability level is to the right level. So right there, that distant attack isn't there because my airship level uh, ability, my infantry cover, is not level 20. Now, let's see here. How much is this? Oh, I need airship level 47. Well, I guess I'm screwed there for a minute. Um, so when you're doing that make sure to keep that in mind while you're building all this stuff up uh, make sure that when you're doing all this you can uh, get these up to the right level so that way you can use all the abilities as much as possible so if say you have a blue and a purple and this one requires it to be a level 20 then uh, you know the common sense would say to put that one uh, your common sense would say to uh, sorry we're doing red guard raids would say to put the correct color with the right one so that way you get the best abilities out of all of your different gears so that's something to keep in mind while you guys are doing your airship abilities um, again I've done some airship videos but I mean obviously when you're doing all this make sure that you keep your stars up so that way you get better uh, stuff out of it and by doing your stars you come into here to enhance abilities and you can get these stars upgraded so you can enhance all these I've been trying to push five stars and four stars, so uh, I don't have a lot of these. But uh, yeah, so you want to definitely push these stars up. They give you a better bonus down here, right, right underneath this whole area. It says bonuses. This one gives me a plus 42. The level five ones give you a plus 55. I don't know, it gives you a 42, and then the other one gives you a 30. My bad. When you upgrade, you get a 55. Anyway. So do that, uh, airship level needs to be leveled up as much as possible, so I mean, as far as going for your airship stuff, go for uh, your airship XP, um, go for your airship XP here in the spirit mines, yeah, I'm on a really low level of the mines right now, because I have no troops, kind of sucks, but you know, gotta do what you gotta do. Uh, so you can get your airship XP and your uh, guardian components here your large uh, so get that get that stuff upgrade your airship you can oh, oh. clicking the wrong buttons you can get airship XP from here as well and your co components your gears also so I mean make sure you keep up on all that stuff so you can get all your gears and stuff like that um, combining gears is kind of it's it's really slow and tedious and it's not worth a whole lot of time um, also, so, guards, a whole lot of new stuff has come out with guards, so, here's my crappy little list of guards, so, uh, yeah, it's, it's sad and depressing, and it makes me cry a little bit at night, but, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do with what you have. So, um, something that a lot of people didn't know, and they've been asking me, was, in a battle report, so let's go here, Oh, Golem's awesome, by the way. If you guys haven't done that, make sure... Oh, I guess that's a KOA term. It's the werewolf. So, a lot of people only have these four guards in their attack. Um, now, let me get somebody to... So, um, these guys are... One of these guys are going to share a report... Um, but so, but when the, uh, you, you use these, 
Use these new guards. I cannot talk worth a shit today. I'm sorry about that, guys. So, the guard, you have all these guys, and then you come into here, your recruitment hall. Um, you have all these new guards out here. So you have your uh, captain. He can replace uh, this guy or that guy. If you have either of those guys. Uh, you have Kitty, who is Master of Defense, so she can replace uh, this guy right here. No, that's a weapon master defense. This guy. So this guy normally is only for defense. So army attack, estate defense, trap damage. Now you can get this guard here and you can get better stats for your regular attacking and defending stats. So, I mean, that's something that's worth looking into. Um, this guy right here is your strategist. So this guy right here can be replaced. So this guy's reinforcement capacity, training capacity. So when you're attacking people, you can get these heroes and you can replace your regular heroes with these guys. And these guys have some insane buffs with them. If you look at, I mean, 100% with three stars. That's that's stupid. 100%, um, 100%. I mean, that's that's crazy right there. Also, more places to, so you can have multiple guards. Your advisor right here. You can replace her. Oh, uh, you can replace him. So he's your silver protection guy. You can replace him with this guy, and you can have better health and all this good stuff. And then this guy can replace your ambassador, which is this guy. So this guy's your reinforcement capacity. So you can have a grand total of, let's see here, um, one, two, three, four, five, five or six guards you can have. Oh, these guys are awesome. Anyway, but you can have about five guards, six guards instead of four guards now. So, I mean, that, that increases your stats a lot. Some of these guys have a lot of crazier stats nowadays. You look at people's stats, you wonder how the hell they do it. One way would be that they uh, they do these guards. Another way would be that they do uh, your airship uh, gears, components, whatever you want to call them. These things right here. Uh, they go all the way up to... Um, go all the way up to this uh, epic. So you can have a max of 70 infantry attack, defense... And then all of these, and then so these are basically like your justice gems and your hope gems on an airship. So whenever, okay, so let me explain this. When you're attacking somebody or defending somebody, if you're attacking with your airship, these abilities will be in place. So all of these buffs that you have off of these things right here will only be in place where your airship is at. So if you're attacking somebody with your airship, that'll be there. Um, and also if you have say your uh, temporary wonder and you have your um, air cannon which allows you to have your uh, airship event uh, abilities there while your airship's gone you'll have all of those buffs with it so those are things to keep in mind also you can hire mercenary airships so you can have more airships so and yeah like I said in previous videos fun sucks make sure that that costs a lot of money so those are a lot of good new ways that you can get uh, new new stats, new buffs. Of course, you also have, uh, I just found this out and I was kind of mad because of how much I've spent on demon gear. But now, the price of these guys right here, your, uh, uh, oh. <sighs> go to craft. So these guys right here are now 64,000 gold instead of 100,000. So now they're getting cheaper. So, I mean, that's what, uh, $200 packs versus like four, three, something like that. I don't know. My mask going to be off. I know what it is. But anyway, see what I mean though? I mean, things are getting cheaper. There are days where you can now get your demon hunter fragments and all the fragments that you normally would use for your demon gear, um, cheaper on your daily deals. So there's a day for, uh, I have gold that's ready to withdraw. That's neat. So on days you can get demon gear. There's also the little gold packages on the 99 cent deal. And you can have a chance of getting demon here fragment, demon gear fragments stuff there. And then you can also get your airship component gears. Uh, I should find out the name of them. So I'm not calling them the wrong things. These parts. So your bearings, your cannons, your all these parts that you can get you can get the blue ones on Friday I believe it is I saw it and had to do it so anyway so you can get those and you can get those for pretty cheap so I think 20 bucks and you can get all of the ones you're gonna need and then to upgrade these instead of using refining gems 
uh, you use uh, other parts. So you can go to there and you can de uh, you get you have to have these uh, gears right here. And to get more, you have to uh, uh, take apart and use the parts off of these other parts. If that makes any sense whatsoever. And then you can enhance these to get better buffs. So that's something for you guys to keep in mind. Um, of course, probably the easiest way to get these guards and to get these airship parts is, you know, packs. Um, sucks. But you can get all these heroes and you can get all of this other stuff through packs. So keep that in mind when you guys are building up your stats. Um, those are ways to build up your stats better now, now that they have made it even more expensive to play this game. But is what it is so um yep i'm gonna be back and making videos again um i can't say that i'm gonna be spending as much money as i used to because i i uh i spent too much money and it's kind of kicking me in the butt now so i gotta be careful of what i do here um but i'm gonna be here and i'm gonna be playing from a, a very slight spender standpoint so i know it's not as exciting but we're gonna have the alliance ultimate alliance conquest stuff like that where i can just go all out and still fight people and make videos of that so i mean that's still gonna be a lot of fun um let's see here what am i missing banners are so much cheaper now i mean it's insane so like on the yesterday it was like the 20 dollars package gave you five thousand banners i mean the hundred dollars used to only get you like five thousand banners not even so now you can get banners and upgrade them and upgrade your buildings for better stats so banners are a great way of doing that you can get free banners through uh your different stores like your alliance your hero store maybe no i might be i might be lying on that yeah you can get uh your banners through there you can get your banners if you're r5 or r4s set your uh hero stature to uh the current tasks to these you can get a lot of banners this way good way of doing that so keep that in mind um, free ways to get stats guys free way um, um, lately I've been all about free so keep that in mind while you guys are doing all this because this stuff I mean 2,000 is that's expensive it's expensive so keep that in mind so so um yeah so if there's anything you guys want me to cover or about any of the new updates, please let me know. Um, I'm going to be back making videos again, so uh, flood the comments with some stuff that you guys would like to see. I'm glad to be back with you guys. I'm sorry for the lawn break, and you know, but real life happens, and you just got to roll with the punches. So uh, thank you guys for everything you do, and I'll be back in the next video.